You are listening to Proof Text, a Glossa House podcast exploring the scripture and all things related to it. New episodes are released daily. For more information, check out glossahouse.com and subscribe to our channels on Spotify and YouTube. Welcome and enjoy. Hello and welcome to Proof Text. I am Michael Halcom, and this is an episode of a Hebrew reading. We've been in the book of Jonah for a little bit now, and what we do is go verse by verse and word by word. Usually I have a slideshow kind of thing set up. We look at the verse as a whole, look at each word, and then look at the verse as a whole again. I didn't have time to prepare that this week, so we're just going to look at stepbible.org and go through the verse as a whole, word by word, and then as a whole again. So Let's do that. I'm going to turn to Jonah 3, verse 1, and there we go. We got it here. So let's just uh, have a cold read here of verse 1. Um, Vayahi debar Yahweh el Yonah shenet lemor. All right. So let's go ahead and look at each word we have here. We have vay, the vav, with the patak yod. Uh, vayahi, 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 and then we have the debar, or actually devar. Sorry, I think I said debar earlier. So vayahi devar, and then we have Yahweh, or which some people will say Adonai. So vayahi debar Yahweh. El, el. Now remember when you have the aleph is the first word or letter, and then a vowel under it. Uh, I tend to take the sound of the vowel. That's the one place where I'll treat Aleph as a sort of placeholder, but not always. Um, so if there was like a Shiva or something perhaps under there, uh, we might use the A, ah, or if there was a Patach under there, uh, it would be the same sound, A. Ah. But here we have El, Yona, Shenet, Shenet, Le, Amor or le amor, le amor. Now le amor, le amor, le amor. All right. So, um, vayhi devar Yahweh el yona shenet le amor. And that's it. This is a very short verse, and the word of the Lord came a second time to Jonah. Is what it's saying. Saying, right? And the word of the Lord came a second time to Jonah, saying. So we have vayhi devar. Yahweh of Yonah Shinet le Amor. One more time. Vayahi devar Yahweh el Yonah Shinet le Amor. And that's it. Super short episode here, just a couple minutes long. Remember, if you're working on your Hebrew, read out loud. This is key to building language fluency. I say it in these episodes all the time. Read out loud. Every word, read out loud. Every phrase, read out loud. Every verse, read out loud. Every paragraph, every chapter, read out loud. It's what helps you in building confidence and, in turn, language fluency. Read out loud, just like we've been doing here. Go ahead, Jonah 3.1, that's where we're at today. And I'll stop there and say, I hope that helps. Interested in growing your ancient language skills but not sure where to start? Glow's House can help. From illustrated readers and short stories to lexicons and grammars, Glossa House offers a variety of resources for beginning, intermediate, and experienced ancient language learners. Head to glossahouse.com today. Glossa House, language resources for the global community.